Are you ready to live it up with all things summer? After more than a year of restricted pandemic living, summer's back and it's absolutely glorious. Here in the greater Iowa City area, we're seeing the return of many of our summer events and festivals. There's no better time to get outside and find something fun to do than over the 4th of July. So where can you find fireworks and other fun stuff to do in the Iowa City Metro to celebrate our nation's Independence Day? Hey there, my name is Emily Farber and I'm a realtor with Lepid Crater Realtors in Iowa City. I create YouTube content all about real estate and the greater Iowa City area. This week I'm taking a little break from my usual visit video topics to let you know where you can go to find 4th of July festivities. But if you're here mainly because you're just interested in buying or selling real estate, be sure to hit that subscribe button and ring the bell to be notified each time a new video comes out, which is every Friday. If you want to chat with me about your real estate buying, selling, or relocation plans, you can find all of my contact information down below in the description box of this video. Reach out to me. I would love to chat with you. If you're watching this on your phone, all you need to do is tap the title of this video and that description box will open up. Down there, you'll find all my contact information as well as a couple of free downloadable guides that should be useful if you're buying or selling real estate or thinking about relocating to this area. Number one, Iowa City's Summer of the Arts is a season long celebration of arts, music, and culture with several different festivals throughout the summer. The Iowa City Jazz Festival is a two-day event on July 2nd and 3rd filled with well-known local and national jazz musicians and it's capped off with a large fireworks display the evening of July 3rd. The best place to watch the fireworks is from the Pentecrest, which is the area surrounding the old Capitol building downtown on campus. Be sure to bring a blanket or a lawn chair to sit on the grass. I'll leave a link for the Iowa City Summer of the Arts in the description box so that you can check out all of the other fun things there are to do in Iowa City this summer. Two, the city of Coralville hosts Fourth Fest, an annual 4th of July multi-day event which includes a 5K run walk, food, free family friendly events, a free outdoor concert. This year it's gonna be country and gospel singer Josh Turner a parade and fireworks. The fireworks will be held at ST Morrison Park on the evening of July 4th. And again, bring a blanket or a lawn chair so you can sit on the grass. I'll leave a link for Coralville's 4th Fest in the description box of this video. Number three, if you're open to a bit of driving, you could head about 30 minutes to the north, go up to Cedar Rapids, because each summer Cedar Rapids holds the Freedom Festival, which begins in June and runs through July and culminates with the area's largest fireworks display on the 4th of July. The fireworks will be shot off of the First Avenue Bridge, but the Second Avenue Bridge will be open for entry beginning at 7 p.m. on the 4th. You must be wearing your Freedom Festival pin for free entry, or you can purchase a pin at the gate. If you buy a pin in advance, you can find them at the Cedar Rapids and Marion Hy-Vee Food and Drug Stores, Casey's General Store, the Alliant Powerhouse Box Office, Collins Aerospace Company Store, the Eastern Iowa Arts Academy, or the Freedom Festival Office. The pin is just $5. I'll leave a link for the Freedom Festival in, you got it, the description box of this video. Well, there you have it three great options for watching some fireworks displays this year in the Eastern Iowa Corridor. Whatever your summer plans hold, I hope you enjoy yourself in proper summer fashion. We have all earned it. Hey, it's been fun and I'll catch you later. <laughs>